Coming to you from our GIS studios, I am Janelle Norville and this is your Midday News Brief. The St. Lucia Air and Seaport Authority SLASPA is preparing to undertake the first phase of the Hiranora International Airport Redevelopment Project due to begin in the coming weeks. The 175 million US dollar project will deliver a modern facility in compliance with international aviation regulations, passenger friendly and open a world of business opportunity to the island. The project will significantly improve airside and airfield operations to include a new traffic control tower, elevating over 100 feet, five new parking aprons with connecting air bridges to her 337,000 square feet terminal building and new road infrastructure and traffic management system. St. Lucia recently hosted the Caribbean's first round of expanded constituency workshops for the seventh funding cycle of the Global Environment Facility, GEF. The GEF has proven a valuable development partner for countries providing over $18.1 billion in grants and an additional $94.2 billion in co-financing for more than 4,500 projects in 170 countries. GEF convenes its expanded constituency workshop to keep national focal points, convention focal points, civil society organizations, and other stakeholders up to date on GEF strategies, policies, and procedures, and to encourage coordination. Now, in its seventh replenishing cycle, GEF will allocate 4.1 billion US dollars towards conservation activity globally, of which 52 million will be programmed for June 2019, and 206 million will be allocated to the Caribbean for the next four years. Over 120 representatives from 16 countries across the region participated in the expanded constituency workshop. That's all for the Midday News Brief. Thanks for tuning in.